unequal balls are placed in a cylindrical jar? How much of water covers the two balls? Let's find the answer. Two balls 1 2 inch radius and other 3 inch radius are placed in a cylindrical jar of 9 inches diameter. Find the volume of water necessary to cover both the balls. A right circular cylinder can be built by using circles of the same size. A cylinder has three phases, two circular phase and one curved phase. And the volume of the cylinder can be found by multiplying the area of the circular base and the height, which is pi r square h. If the sphere at the cylinder of same radius is taken, then the volume of sphere is 2 by 3 volume of cylinder, which is the base area and the height, and here the height is the diameter 2r, so volume of sphere is 4 by 3 pi r cube. H. Water level in the cylinder is the summation of this 3 inch plus x plus 2 inch. So what is x? Let's find out x. And in this right triangle, this x is one of the leg and other leg is this 4 inch. So summation of these two legs is the hypotenuse. So hypotenuse is the 2 inch plus uh, 3 inch which is 5 square. Then the legs. Legs is one is x, other one is the 4 inch. So this x square is this uh, hypotenuse minus other leg. So which is nine so x is three. And now the height is Summation of this 2 inch plus the x plus the 3 inch. So it is totally 8 inches. Volume of water necessary to cover the balls can be found out by subtracting the volume of 2 spheres from the volume of cylinder. Volume of cylinder pi r square h, volume of sphere 4 by 3 pi r cube, take the pi common outside and the radius of the cylinder is 9 by 2. So 9 by 2 into 9 by 2 and the height we found it as 8 inches so into 8. Then the volume of the two spherical balls so take 4 by 3 pi we took common outside. Then the radius of the first uh, ball is 3 inch, so 3 cube, and the other ball is 2 inch, so 2 cube. Then this 2 can cancel with 8, it's 4 times. Again, cancel this with this to 2. 9 into 9 into 2, it's 81 into 2, 162. Then here 3 cube is 27 and 2 cube is 8 so 27 plus 8 which is 35. Next 4 by 3 into 35 which is 46.66. And subtract this with 162 from 162. So it's 115.34. And multiply this answer with this pi value 3.14. So the answer is 362.16 inches cubic inches.